Today we shall reflect on the life of Saint Victor of Marseilles the emperor Maximian wrecking with the blood of the Thabaean legion and many other martyrs arrived at Marseilles where the church then flourished the tyrant breathed here nothing but slaughter and fury his coming filling the people with fear and alarm it was in this state of affairs that victor a christian officer in the troops went about from house to house at night visiting the faithful and inspiring them with contempt of a temporal death and the love of eternal life he was soon seized and brought before the prefects Asterius and Eutychius who exhorted him not to forfeit the fruit of all his services and the favor of his prince for the worship of a dead man as they called Jesus but Victor boldly declared his renunciation of those recompenses if he could not enjoy them without being unfaithful to Christ who had died to redeem all human kind from evil the whole court heard him with shouts of rage bound hand and foot victor was dragged through the streets of the city exposed to the blows and insults of the populace he was then brought to the tribunal of the prefect who thinking that his resolutions must have weakened by now pressed him to adore their god but the saint filled with the holy spirit expressed his respect for the emperor and his contempt for their so-called gods he was then hoisted on the rack and tortured at length until he was ordered to be cast into a dungeon where however god visited him and comforted him astounded by the heavenly light the soldiers who guarded the prison cast themselves at victor's feet pleading for pardon and seeking baptism going with them to the seaside Victor baptized them and returned to the prison furious when informed of the conversion of the guards Maximian had them hauled up before him but they were firm in their confession of Jesus Christ and so were beheaded Victor was then taken from the cell and was tormented with leather thongs prior to being brought again before the emperor asked again to offer incense to an idol of Jupiter Victor kicked it off its pedestal for the enraged the emperor had his foot chopped off while a little later ordered his body to be crushed under the grindstone of a handmill the executioners turned the wheel and when a part of his body was crushed the mill broke down but he was found still alive and finally he was beheaded His body along with those of the guards was thrown into the sea but being cast ashore they were buried by a Christian in a grotto hewn out of a rock